I'm so unbelievably angry. And upset. I cannot believe that I go through all of Act 1, all of Act 2, and then die to a side quest and I'm not even sure if that's a monster that is actually part of the side quest or not. I'm not sure if I kill that and I complete the side quest or if that was just like a randomly unfortunate event. I mean I have no words like I'm so angry right now and just kind of annoyed for myself. 37 and a half hours, 41-ish thousand kills, level 36. Yeah, like, yeah, like, I'm nowhere near completing the challenge, because I've still got to go through, like, well, all of Act, most of Act 3, all of Act 4, and then Epic and Legendary. But, I've got such good equipment, and oh my god, I'm so... Ugh. Right. I guess all I can do now is continue on with this Let's Play and finish normal, at least, on the Let's Play. I don't know if I'll record Epic and Legendary, probably not. Unless there's, like, a demand for it, which at the moment there's absolutely no demand for anything whatsoever, because, you know, I have comments on my videos. Oh well. This'll be, like, part, I don't even know, like, part 40 or something. I guess, seeing as I can't do the No Deaths Hardcore X-Max Challenge anymore, since I'm out, I can try the fewest deaths possible, because I really like this character. It'd be good if I complete Legendary with only one death, that would be very impressive. But one death! Oh my god, I am so pissed off. Right, what I'm going to do now is, at least now I'm more prepared for the shit fucking... Oh my god! Just goes to show that death's right around the corner, like you never know. I must be prepared for this challenge all the fucking time. The thing is, as well, is I've analysed the footage, and I basically fired a potion whilst I was trapped and I mean I should have run away when I saw the hero but it's kind of my own stupid fault but I was on full health and then just like died in about 10 seconds there wasn't really much I could do I got trapped and then just like surrounded and my health just went to zero. Oh my god So I couldn't have fired a potion. I tried to regrowth. It didn't want to activate for some reason. There's no guarantee that it would have saved me anyway. It's only... gives 630 health. Oh my god. I came far. I did rather well. But... I might as well find the graveyard. Find the grave. Wow, this take this has taken an absolute turn for the shit. That's not gonna work. Right, I was trying to do If we can't do the no death X Max challenge, let's do the fewest deaths possible X Max challenge. Because One death, X Max challenge. That should not have happened. That should not have happened in any way. You, Grattlebone, you are a prick. You are going down. You are so going down. There you go. I don't know if you had just extreme damage or if I got surrounded. I don't know. I don't know if it could have been prevented. 
I guess it's my carelessness for not knowing that there'll be a super scary boss down here. But yeah, I'll continue recording at least until the end of normal. Wow, he actually hits really hard. That doesn't help. Hey, what is this? Uh, that's one for my caravan. Fuck. I'm still upset over it. Genuinely upset. Thirty-seven and a half hours comes to that. I mean, I suppose it's a lot better than dying to like. Well, even normal Hades would be annoying. But dying to legendary Hades, that would suck so hard. Like hours and hours of effort comes to that. At least I died relatively early. Relatively early in this challenge. It's irrelevant. It's still 37 and a half hours. 37 hours. Wow. Yeah. He wasn't even the quest. He was random. He didn't have to spawn. Just my luck. He hits hard, he has a trap I don't stand a chance. Should have seen him and ran. But instead I went in. Like an idiot. Big dumb idiot that I am. Oh well. Oh well, what can you do? Just gonna try not to die again. Oh, there's another tall school crusher. Actually, maybe these are for the quest, I don't know. Seems unlike. To be fair, he's purple, which makes me think he is. Purple's usually, in fact, yeah, purple's quest related, so maybe I do have to kill him for the quest anyway. So maybe it wasn't randomly generated. What's annoying is just the fact that they're so beef. They've got such high speed as well. Now don't die again. He doesn't have a lot of health, but he has a lot of speed and damage. Music sounds quite sad actually, it's like sad piano music. As if the game itself is mourning my loss. I don't know if I'll try this challenge again. Well, I mean, I will. I mean, I don't know what class I'll do. death challenge. Not a mage, because it would be too similar to this character, which I actually really like as well. I'm so pissed off. No one's ever beat the challenge with a summoner. More importantly, no one's ever beaten the challenge with an unjoint summoner. I thought I was going to be the first, but unfortunately no. It is not to be. Could try a melee character, could try an archer. 
melee character would be good actually. I've got an idea for a um, melee spear brigand. Ooh, some fairly nice loot, nonetheless. any use for me, unfortunately. So yeah, sell all that junk. Get a shield up, and... This is... what I was scared of. Barmanu. Or Barmanu. Barmanu? 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 Whatever. He is genuinely tough. Dying to him would still be bad, obviously, but it makes a lot more sense than dying to fucking Neanderthal mountain heroes. Stupid speed and strength and whatnot. I think he's here. Yeah, here he is. Fuck. It's just he's got a lot of guards. Yeah, he's genuinely tough. And obviously there's going to be three of him. He does complete the side quest. If you kill him. I'm so pissed off. I could have not gone in the cave. And I would still be alive. Save the quest for later. No. No one to blame but myself. Oh well. What can you do? To be fair, I would have been genuinely surprised if I actually beat legendary babies with no deaths. But it was all going so well. Carefully asked me to also do stun and possibly cold damage plus my fire damage, I'm not sure. It would be easier to kill this boss if you didn't have so many bodyguards. Fuck. I want to say it's cold, I want to say it's fire, but it's probably both. Which my resistance is a sense of fire. Whoa! Shit! I've been stunned and I'm gonna die again, probably. I do not believe this! I do not believe this! I. 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 Fuck this game. Fuck this game. I mean, it doesn't matter now if I die. Barman you. You killed me, you prick. I, I, I don't know anymore. I don't know. How many more times am I going to die? I, I don't, I've, I've become sort of like, I don't care anymore, like, obviously I'd want to die as few times as possible, but it's kind of just like, well, the first death was an accident, the second death, Barman U, is very tough, because it's like, if you get stunned by his bolts, you're basically going down. Wow. Well, this part is shit. Let's see if they go like buses and just die three times in a row. Hmm. Wow. What are the fucking useless shit pile of death they're gonna throw at me? Let's see if we can do the two deaths X Max challenge. Hardly the no deaths. so pissed off. It was all going so well. And yet it's all in vain. All in vain.
What would be really fitting is Fades of Black by Metallica just playing right now. Just to mourn my losses. Yes, Barman you would be a lot easier to kill if you didn't have a shitload of mobs guarding you. This is the worst side quest ever. He's been killed twice already. And he's got super high speed. I guess there's no fear of death anymore. It's kind of something, I guess. Oh! Oh, look at that! Look at that! Oh! Well! There you go! Who gives a fuck anymore? You get hit once, you're dead. Alright. 25% stun resistance. No, that's just... That's just meaningless now. I hate this game. I don't. But, seriously. It's a really good game, it's just... I don't know. I, I, I... Do I skip Barmanu and come back to him? Three deaths. Oh, I've gone from zero for 37 and a half hours. I do all that farming, all that shit. Not that I actually found anything to be fair, but... <sighs> New one. There's no hope of stopping them. The Neanderthals have the weapons now. It would be death. Yeah, you're right. I should have just ignored this cave. Only death can come from this stupid cave. Fucking hell. Barmanu is just invincible. He calls down meteors, which do insane damage. They take out like half your health, and then they stun you, and then he just kills you. You're dead. You got damn dead. Don't matter that you're level 36. Don't matter that you got 2,000 health or 332 defensive ability. Doesn't matter that you got 459 DPS. You got damn dead. 25% stun resistance. You you're gonna die. 66% cold and fire resistance. No, sir. You are going to die. I... I think I'm just gonna... Right. Try and kill this fucker. Try and kill him. know what kind of class like I don't know what class would be the easiest to beat this challenge with because I thought like I really like this class it's got high damage and you've got regrowth in case anything goes wrong in theory pets are useless now nothing matters anymore so it's complete the game Else, which is boring. Okay. 
he is slowly dying. Jesus Christ, that's me. Oh, hello. Ooh, I actually managed to survive that one. That's surprising. What's annoying is that you can't decrease the recharge of potions. Seems like that's fixed. No matter what you do. I don't actually survive that one, I don't know. I've just been a bit lucky. Too bad that I couldn't survive. Two deaths to Barman you and one death to those fucking heroes. The Barman you death was pointless because I already had died. And now I'm on three deaths. Oh shit. He's going down, just ridiculously annoying. Considering this is a side quest, this is goddamn ridiculous. This guy's tougher than the Telki. This is like the toughest guy I've ever faced. And obviously there's three of them, he's got ridiculous speed and he's dual wielding maces. And he calls down fucking meteors from the fucking sky. Oh! Nope, nope, nope. Right, that's one now. That's another now. Right, they're all dead. Just like me. Who cares anymore? Who gives a shit? Hmm. I literally don't know anymore. I don't know. Three deaths. Wow. Two to bomb you. One, two. <sighs> Next fountain I'm calling it a night. Probably the worst cave I've ever seen. weapons of our ancestors, the Neanderthals would be all-powerful. I thought we were lost. Oh, this was all my fault. Well, to be fair, I mean, I did die three times to Thank you, do stranger. This. I feel terrible for what I've done. But you can tell my father. I'll come. You better feel terrible. You killed me three times. My son, alive! Oh, happiness! When he returns to me, I will forgive. We are safe now, thanks to you, warrior. What a load of shit. I don't know what would have saved me there. Like, how do you fight? How do you survive those meteors? Stun resistance? It's like it's like it's cold and fire, but at the same time, my resistance is really high, so god knows. Yes, next fountain, I'm calling it a night like fuck this game. Oh, 
I really like the character, but I'm a lot less motivated to play now. Now that I've died and I'm no longer in the challenge. The thing is, is I don't want to run at one all over again to attempt the challenge again because it's so slow. Like, it takes like five hours just to get anywhere. But yes, I don't know what class I'll run. So I'm going to ice caverns. Hello. Over the mountain. Now, into the caves of ice you go. It is the only way. And after that... Ah, but you'll see for yourself. How do I see? Wind told me when it felt your breath. How do I know? Earth told me when it heard your... Yes, you've come far, far for the curved blade and its master. Through the ice caves, otherwise you won't catch up. He moves quickly, you must too. Yes, the ice caves, and then... Anyway, there's a fountain here. So, yep. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it, despite my miserable failure. Fuck. 41,000 kills. 38 hours. Leave a like, share, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Take care and goodbye, folks, and try not to die if you're planning on running a hardcore X-Max challenge. Especially not to shitty Neanderthal heroes. Bye-bye!